Hello fellow crazy campers. Jeremy from Crazy Camper Crew. If you're crazy like me, you can't just go camping to go camping. Uh, we always bring our projection screen uh, and usually I make one out of a king size sheets, poles, ropes. This year I decided to go ahead and buy one from, um, from Amazon. I found it for about $160. I just got it today. Figured I'd uh, kind of uh, show you how it puts together. Um, and how small it is, how easy it is to transport, things like that. Well, here it is. <clears throat> it is a 120 inch projection screen. And it comes in this nice carrying case, small enough to, you know, not too big um, to, to collapse. When I usually brought my own, it was just a king size sheet and some, you know, the 10 foot pieces of uh, metal pole. So this is actually. A little bit easier to get around and, and secure, and uh, I'm hoping I haven't put it up yet, but hopefully, hopefully it'll be uh, you know a nice a nice screen. All right, so we got the contents out of the box. We have all the uh, screws, stakes, rope, owner's manual. The screen itself came folded up in this tissue paper and put in this protective sleeve, this extra protective bag, which is good because if anybody knows this screen you're going to want to make sure you keep it as clean as possible and you don't want to get any rips or tears so it's nice that it comes in this extra protection the uh, frame itself is aluminum tube construction tube uh, square tubing is what I'm looking for and it looks like it's all labeled to make it easy to put together and I'm sure it just holds together with those uh, wing nuts or how, whatever you want to call them all right, so this is what is in the bag. I mean, this is what we've got together so far. Excuse the mess over here. I had to move some things out of the way. I didn't realize this was going to be this big. I'm impressed with the size. <clears throat> I flipped it over before I took this video, but the, the bolts all come in this other side. These will obviously fold open to make the pedestals I stand on. And they've got these snaps all around. My next step is to put the screen on and then we'll stand it up. And we'll unfold the feet and see what it looks all put together. Okay, here it is installed. It took me about 15-20 minutes to install it for the first time. Now that I know exactly how it goes together, it'll probably be a little quicker. <clears throat> Good things about this. The screen is nice and tight. There's really no wrinkles. There's one seam that goes down the middle. Um, as you can see, it's not a seam per se, but it's a crease. I'm sure that that will eventually disappear. It is pulled very tight, so the fabric itself has some stretch to it, so you would, the buttons don't, I would say they don't exactly line up, but they're designed, they're spaced out exactly, so you actually have to pull this screen tight, which is great. When you're using, when I was using the uh, king size sheets, I would have a, a ton of wrinkles and I couldn't get it pulled t this tight, so this is excellent. Good, hard, stable, sturdy construction. It has holes in the, f the feet here for the stakes. You have four stakes for the feet, and then you have four extra stakes for the guide. There's a little bolt. There's some bolts there that screw into the top, and then you fish the rope through and over to keep it secured. Another good thing is if, you, if you're camping or outside and you know that you're going to have some weather, it's just obviously just you can just pull this off and snap it. Take, you can leave the frame up and you can take down the screen this way the wind can come through bad thing about it <clears throat> if I had to say anything it is not a pass through screen meaning you only can project from the front sometimes I like to set it up where I put my projector in the back and it projects on the screen reverse the image and then I would be able to see it without having the projector out front but very in my opinion a small price to pay for a great screen and at a great price in my opinion and this is plenty big for what I'm, I need ever um, I like the construction it's aluminum it shouldn't rust I'm not going to leave it outside but if it does get rained on it's not going to be ruined or anything and I love the stuff that comes with it the bag this it's very collapsible and easily easily movable so this is it very happy with this purchase and it all fits nicely back in the case. A little bit difficult getting some of the pieces apart. Nothing that I couldn't manage, obviously, by myself. Um, but it took me 
about 10 minutes to get it back in, in the case. Some of these products that I find, not this in particular, the screen, but tents and things that come in special bags, it takes a lot of effort to get them back in the bag. You have plenty of room in this bag. Um, didn't have to squeeze it in or anything. So, and the bag is pretty pretty nice. All in all, I give this an excellent rating.